And from the U.S., Brock Lesnar! He was the most sought-after free agent in the sport of mixed martial arts. The former collegiate wrestling champion Brock Lesnar chose to make his initial mark in the world of MMA with tonight's K-1 Dynamite USA. Known as the next big thing in professional wrestling, he very well could become just that in mixed martial arts, Bill. You know what, man? It's just, uh, we're going to see tonight. There's no question about it. I mean, Brock is not a guy to turn down competition. Brock is a guy that that never played collegiate football. Brock is a guy who quit professional wrestling at the top of his career. The last time he wrestled was with a guy named Goldberg. Okay, so I know. He quit both of those to go and try his, try his, uh, he, he wanted to be a professional football player. Okay, now who tries to be a professional football player with no collegiate experience? A guy who wants to complete a dream. And, and even up, a, even, I'm sorry, but even sorry. after he did get released, the Minnesota Vikings still wanted to send him to NFL right. Europe because they saw the aggression of this guy, the strength of this guy. There could be something there. You opened up an interesting can of worms, Mr. Goldberg. Uh, we were talking about the crowd and some of the reaction during the uh, Sakuraba Gracie fight. Any uh, memories of WrestleMania 20 MSG, your last fight with uh, Brock Lesnar? You know what? It was an honor, man. It was an honor. I worked for a company that uh, I'll never get credit for, uh, that I can tell you, but uh, to have, to have my last match at Madison Square Garden and to be wrestling a guy who's such a stand-up guy like Brock Lesnar, man, it, it was awesome. Now, Billy, would you ever get in there and, and take on a guy like this in, in an you know, MMA you event? You know how many times that question's been asked of, asked of me, and, and, and I'm 40 years old, man. I mean, let's be perfectly honest. You don't look a day over 39 I, uh, You know what? I'm old, man. <laughs> I, I may co-own a Muay Thai school, and I may have been training for years and years and years. But my body has been through absolute hell. Yeah, I, I, I got to tell you. And you know what? 10 years ago and 15 years ago and 20 years ago, if I didn't choose to go the way that I went, I'd be damned if, I, if you could keep me out of that room. And, and this is why Brock Lesnar is doing this, folks. The way Bill feels right now, it's just because age and injuries have caught up. Well, that's not the case for Brock. And we sat there with Brock two days ago. We said, why did you do this? And he said, I, this is the time for me to do it. I don't have to worry about money. I want to go out there and try and be the best in something that nobody else will do. He's about to enter the ring of reality. What are the keys to victory for Brock Lesnar? LA, well, first and foremost, Brock has got to tonight. stay mentally focused. He's on a big stage here. He's trying something he's never tried before, and he's got to go in there calm, collective, and figure out what to do step by step. He's got to secure the takedown. Being 106 and 5, an amateur wrestler, and being as big and strong as he is, he's got to take it to the ground. And when he gets it to the ground, he's got to start the ground and pound and finish with putting that guy's face in the end of the match. Right Longtime fan of MMA. And uh, now finally making his Jim debut after training Lesnar. for more than a year as we take you to the tail of the tape for this main event at Dynamite UFC. USA. Brock Lesnar is 29, 6'2", 262 pounds with a background in wrestling. Mitsu Kim is 32, 6'1", 255 pounds, was a judo medalist at the 96 Olympics. Ladies and gentlemen, we welcome you to the Los Angeles Memorial Coliseum for the featured bout of the evening as SoftBank presents Dynamite USA in association with Pro Elite and our heavyweight featured attraction. Our main event of the evening, a heavyweight special attraction scheduled three five minute rounds. And now, ladies and gentlemen in attendance and MMA fans joining us around the world, live from Los Angeles, it's showtime. Introducing to you first on my right, fighting out of the blue corner, standing six feet one inch, he weighed in at 255 pounds, raised in the time-honored tradition of judo. His record stands at two wins, five losses, with two wins coming by way of submission. Ladies and gentlemen, here is the 1996 Olympic silver medalist in judo from Seoul, South Korea, known as Mr. Shark, introducing Min Soo Kim. And 
and his opponent across the ring on my left, fighting out of the red corner. Standing six feet two inches, he weighed in at 262 pounds. Specializing in the discipline of wrestling, tonight he makes his much anticipated MMA debut from Minneapolis, Minnesota. Here is the former NCAA heavyweight wrestling champion and three-time WWE World Wrestling Champion, introducing Brock Lesnar. Once again, a referee in charge, Steve Mazzagatti. All right, gentlemen, you know what you're here for. We want a good, clean, fair fight. You need to obey my commands at all times. Protect yourself at all times. Hook them up, gentlemen. Good luck. You can put your gloves on too. Bear. He was landing A-bomb. 
Ladies and gentlemen, we have the time of one minute, nine seconds in round number one. The opponent taps out due to strikes. He is the winner in his MMA debut, Brock Lesnar. Of a minute and nine seconds of one round and Jay Glazer is standing by with Brock Lesnar. Thanks guys here with a victorious Brock Lesnar. Brock, very impressive win in your debut. How much different was this than any other athletic world that you've been in? Well, I, I, all my preparation has been due to my amateur wrestling success. I got a great group of guys behind me. Marty Morgan, Jesse Wallace, Kurt Kozlowski, Greg Nelson. I want to thank everybody for coming, and uh, <laughs> well, I, I, it's fireworks. I got to ask you this. You told us the other day, yeah, I'd, I'd have some nerves. I don't really know what to expect. Was it I fun? I can't even hear you. I can't even hear you, man. Enjoy the fire. <laughs> what, what, was it, when all said and done, come on over here, when all said and done, was it fun? Was it an enjoyable experience, something that you want to continue? Absolutely. I, I enjoyed myself. Um, I was disappointed I couldn't fight the big, uh, the big-headed guy, but maybe, uh, maybe in the near future. Tell me what you want to do next. Where do you want to go? Tell, talk about your progression in the sport. Um, I have no idea. I, I, I want to keep fighting, and uh, I don't know. We'll see what happens. We'll see what promoter wants to step up and uh, hand out some money, and uh, let's get some heavyweight uh, titles on the line. Brock Lesnar, congratulations. Very impressive debut, guys. Send it back to ringside of Moro and Bill. Thanks a lot, Jay. Brock Lesnar, definitely gracious in...